AI is going to surprise us in a very special way. AI claims that the time machine is not only a theoretical concept, but is almost certain to come to pass. However, what scientists and physicists have stated presents a completely different perspective. Let's examine what AI has shown us about creating a time machine and contrast it with the scientific view derived from modern physics and technology. But before we delve into the video, make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to stay in touch. Building a time machine is theoretically possible, but it's no walk in the park. It's a tough and pricey challenge. But before we talk about today's perspective of time machine, let's take a look at what scientists said. According to them, it's possible that we can travel through a time machine, and it can only be one possibility called wormhole. Wormholes are naturally occurring in space. Russian scientists are attempting to find them using radio telescopes. However, time travel via wormholes will be challenging. The closest ones might be thousands of light years distant. Furthermore, you could not be sure where you would finish up even if you could reach them and make it through them alive. However, some physicists have hypothesized that although we don't know how humans might be able to create custom wormholes. According to physics, wormholes should also have a tendency to collapse and crush whatever is inside of them. We would need to figure out how to disable this annoying feature if a time machine was ever used to take advantage of them. Perhaps there is an explanation for the enigmatic phenomenon of dark energy. Instead of slowing down as could have been predicted, astronomers discovered in the 1990s that the universe was expanding faster. In Australia, cosmologist Professor Tamara Davis of the University of Queensland claims that there is an anti-gravity force at work that pushes instead of pulls. The majority of the universe is made up of something we don't understand. We refer to it as dark energy. If a wormhole's mouth can be kept open long enough for something to pass through, it can be used for time travel. That necessitates negative energy, which isn't present in the real world. But the dark energy that permeates the universe seems to fit the criteria. If we can identify it, we may use it to prop open a wormhole long enough to pass through one end and emerge on the other. Professor Davis claims that because technology is advancing so quickly, it's possible that we can govern time and space, we are still determining our technical skills and whether we can create wormholes. Who knows what a human civilization of the future will be capable of, though? Yes, now in the time of AI, it is possible soon. But... According to AI, we need a super precise and powerful clock to pull it off, and those aren't exactly a dime a dozen. Creating such a clock is no small feat. Now, why the hefty price tag? For starters, making a time machine would guzzle up a ton of resources, both cash and materials. Imagine needing money and rare stuff to get this machine going. It's like building something out of a sci-fi movie, but in real life. So it's not just about brain power. It's about having the tools and materials to make it all happen. Having a dead-on accurate clock for time travel is no small detail. It's a game changer. Think of this clock as your time travel guidebook. If it's even a smidge off, you might find yourself in a whole different era or, who knows, another universe. The stakes are high because precision is the key to landing at the right time and place. But why the fuss about being precise? Imagine if your clock ticks even a bit too slow or fast, you could end up in a different timeline altogether. It's like aiming for a birthday surprise at 3 p.m. But you might be crashing a New Year's Eve party at midnight if your clock is off. Timing is everything in time travel. Now, why does this matter so much? Picture a super smart fortune teller, your time machine's algorithm, trying to foresee the future based on the information it's fed. If that information is wrong or altered, the predictions get all wonky. So having a clock that's sharper than a laser ensures your time travel journey isn't a wild guess. It's a carefully calculated trip through time and space where every second counts. Now the question is, how does this time machine magic happen? Well, picture a super smart computer like really brainy. This computer is a data processing chump. It can handle massive amounts of info. What it does is scan through all this data, spot patterns and figure out trends. Then it puts on its fortune teller hat and creates a model of the future. This model isn't just any guesswork. It's top notch and highly accurate. Now the tech needed for this time traveling wonder is here and getting more affordable daily. But here's the kicker, the computer power you need for this isn't your regular laptop or desktop. Nope, you're talking about a powerhouse computer, something way beefier. Talking about time machines, a quantum computer is like a superstar in the lineup, but there are other good options too. 
The decision on which path to take depends on what the time machine needs and how much money is ready for the research. Think of it like putting together a super smart toolkit. You could go with a quantum computer, a super brainy one, but wait, there's more. Another choice is using a really strong electromagnetic field. This magical force can bend space and time, creating a kind of shortcut called a wormhole. This is a possible method, but Ron Mullet has another. He has constructed a small-scale device to demonstrate the principles he believes could lead to a functional time machine. The process begins with lasers creating a circulating beam of light within a ring laser. This beam causes the space inside the ring to twist, akin to stirring a cup of coffee, as Professor Mullet from the University of Connecticut describes. As space and time are closely linked, distorting space should, in theory, also distort time. Professor Mullet's theoretical research indicates that with sufficient laser intensity in a confined space, it may be possible to modify the typically linear timeline we all experience. However, he emphasizes that the successful use of a time machine would necessitate a comprehensive understanding of time itself once the technology is realized. If you've ever dreamed of time travel and revisiting the past, we want to hear from you. Drop your thoughts in the comment box below. If you're enjoying our content, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for the latest updates.